Your Excellency, our mother in Lagos State, I greet you from the throne of Odudua. See, everybody move God bless you Adam. and bless the works of your hand. Adam. Thank you for supporting our ever energetic government. Come and see everybody. Come and see. Today I'm here. And I'm very excited to the glory of God, who is the author and finisher of everything. God Almighty, the creator of all of us. I am here at the instance of my uncle. My very dear uncle, a lot of people might not know that Uncle Itwa, you like to call him Pastor Itwa, I call him my uncle, is more of a Yoruba man than an Ishan man. In fact, we borrowed him away to Ishan. Everything about him, everything from Yoruba land. If you like, say no way, you're on your own. If I get into story about how he is a typical Yoruba man, you will understand. He's my uncle. We are blood related. Auntie is here too. And she can testify to it. I can tell you a little bit of story. If you like, keep saying no way, no way. I can even take him away from this church. You won't even see him for more than five years. He has a role to play on this throne. He is a priest. He doesn't like to call himself a priest. You'll be saying, Pastor Itwa, Pastor Itwa, Pastor Itwa. If you don't put priest Itwa, if I come to this church, I will take him away completely. And I will take him to Kingdom of Ife. He has a role to perform there. Auntie, am I lying, Auntie? So next time, when you want to come to this pulpit, you will say, Prince. Pastor Itwa. If you don't put B B B B B B, if you say B I, you are your own. Oh yeah, B B B B. It is only round of applause for him. Pastor Itwa, Prince. From the throne of Odudua. I can't even quantify my love for you. You have been there for me way before I ascended this throne. There is a saying in your land, That's Pastor Prince Itwa or Prince Pastor Itwa. Everything is BPI. Either you put priest first or put pastor first. We are changing your name today from PI to BPI. <laughs> Has anybody here ever seen him gotten angry before? No. He's always smiling. Very charming smile. Very adorable. Wonderful. With his candor, he's always there to support everybody. And that's why the whole world loves you, Pastor Prince Itwa. Not only me, myself here, that is your cousin. Because of our common heritage. When I was about to clock 40 years old, many years ago, you can do the maths. <laughs> I took Pastor Prince Itwa to a lot of my various projects. There was one that he particularly liked by the ocean side. I built an island called Inabe Grand Resort. So I told Pastor Prince Itwa that, Uncle, when I clock 40, I want to celebrate my 40th birthday on this island. And he said, he used to call me that name. He doesn't know how to call me now again. He's, at times he gets confused. He will say, Kabesi, Aburo, Aburo, Kabesi. I will just say, Uncle, you are forgiving. Don't worry. I know you are not used to it. So, honestly speaking and true to his words, 
on my 40th, when I woke up, it was the first person I saw that day. He came and he prayed for me so, so deeply. He took his time and prayed for me on my 40th birthday. And he asked me one question that, Abu, what next now? And I said, I have a calling. Let's join hands together to keep praying. I don't know, but it's my ultimate calling. I'm looking for this platform that I can give my life to service to the entire humanity. Pastor got that in. But to the glory of God, I never knew it would be this close then. This was 2015. And that year, my father, of blessed memory, passed. My predecessor, Onishi Juwadi. The second day, I called pastor. I said, Uncle, that's what I'm talking about. He said, ah, leave everything you're doing. And like about two, three years before that time, I've had a couple of issues family-wise. Honestly speaking, my uncle has been there for me. He's always been there for me. Please, I want you to all say thank you and give him a resounding round of applause. A very, very dependable uncle. I've never seen your kind, honestly, because you've always been there for me, and your amiable wife of blessed memory we grew up together in the family. I saw mommy now, I greeted mommy. She's still with us in spirit, and she will forever be with us. All the good things she did before leaving this world will forever be remembered for good. Uncle, we all love you. We're celebrating you today. I can go on and on and on. Things you've done for me that you don't even know. When we started that journey, it was very tough. I now told me the story of our uh, uh, the mother of uh, BSA Ruling House, uh, Mama Tinuke Ibudalu, the biological mother of my uncle. She went through so much to prepare the ground for me to become only of Ife today. Thanks to her. Please clap for her now. Please. Please. She gave us this product that you are all seeing and emulating today. Uh, BBI. My uncle, I've been looking for a platform to actually celebrate you. I was talking to my own. When I came in, ah, I said, Uncle, oh, this place has changed. You. Uh -uh, this is our place now. Remember, about 13 years ago, I built one platform for you, for you, right into the ocean. Because you called me that time, bro, that platform in Dario uh, Island that you built 2013, come and build one for me now. I said, oh, it's very expensive. You are rich now, go and build it for me, John. I said, yes, sir. I built that platform. He used to go there with the Bidu to pray. It's, they are very close to nature. You know, the, 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 the Spirit of God hovering on top of moving waters. You know, it's very chilly. Uncle just told me now that it's been destroyed. Ah, Uncle, I think I should work on how to resuscitate that platform back for you. So that you can be going there. Nobody can chance my uncle for anything I will fight. Now, when God was about to do this, my journey, we needed to talk to one very strong political leader in this country. We needed to go and push to it. I said, I've been disturbing my uncle all the time. He now called me and said, why are you worried? I'll go with you now. I said, really? He said, ah, come and pick me at home, John. And lo and behold, we were there for five hours. Myself, my uncle, and Yebido and a few other ones. And we kept begging. Uncle, can you remember? Please, on this note, as I'm celebrating you today, and as we are all celebrating you today, heavens will continue to celebrate you. Yeah. You are a good man. You are a good man. You are a good man. I've never seen anybody that will say, I hate or I don't like Pastor Itwa, Prince Pastor Itwa Igudani. I've never seen. You are always smiling, you disarm people with your smile, with your candor, with your warmth, the way you greet people. I have never seen you angry. 
for anything. Even when you lost your darling wife, the way you were so mature about it that we should just celebrate for her, I was really touched. Heavens will continue to be with you.